Oh, oh, the tour is the Western Australian. Oh, He's played a couple right. of interstate games last year, Lou. Waiting now for the ball. Back into play again. There's a snap and shot. A goal by Ojo. I think he's got it through. A good goal. The first of the... But here's a chance now for McKinnon. Two and for uh, McKenzie. He's kicked one goal. That won't be a goal, but it's a mark. Okay. Uh, Darren Ogier. And Ogier attempts to bring up his second. Waiting on Ogier to go for goal number two. There's the mark again. Good play by McKenzie. Spotted him. And, of course, he wasn't under much pressure because he had it all the way. Now, he's only about uh, eight metres out from goal, directly in front. Six points, the difference in favour of uh, Carlton, and Ogier going for goal number two. There it is, he's put it right through the middle. So, at the just on the three-minute mark of this second quarter... Sorry, ...but he comes out with the ball just the same. Gets it up to, uh, to uh, Ogier again. He can have another shot at goal. Beautiful ball. Only 15 metres out, shoots, and it deserves a goal, he's got one. Blues down to Meldrum, chips for goal. It's a pass, a beauty too. Kennedy's mark, Oji rather in the forward pocket. He uh, looked up very well there. I thought initially it was a shot at goal from Meldrum, but he picked out Oji there in the forward pocket and beautifully weighted and given enough height to get over the kangaroo defence. And Darren Ogier, chance for the first goal of the afternoon. Accuracy, all that he wants here. And splits the eye of the needle. The Blues hit the front. Five-minute mark at the MCG. One goal, one. North Melbourne, one behind, one point. And a good, strong mark by Ogier. I thought for a moment there that he may have put Ogier on a bit. He was given away a few free kicks, but his fifth kick towards centre-half forward. High flyer, Dennis. Swooped in there beautifully, Royce Hart style, kicks up towards full foot, Ogier, can't mark, plays on, quick kick, not a bad looking kick by Ogier, has it been paid, it's all clear, second goal to Ogier, fourth goal to the Blues, and they go to 4-3-27, leading North Melbourne 1-3-9, the difference is three goals in Carlton's favour. Dennis chipped in and took a beautiful mark here on the forward line, and after Ogier, who nearly held that one, but recovered really well, and a magnificent snap on his right foot under a lot of pressure from the North Melbourne defence. It's going to go long. Sends Kernahan back to the line. Stephen Kernahan and McCann. Kernahan or Oja? Man in front, Darren Oja. Two hands are better than one. And give it to the man in front. Missing a strong mark to Oja. But really, none of the North Melbourne defenders... Towards half forward. They've all gone underneath it. Behind the pack, Oja! Good pair of hands, Darren Oja, and he's displaying it today. More difficult shot for goal than the one he missed earlier. That's a great mark. He's playing well, Oja. Must have had a few words to say to the umpire, but really, after watching the replay, he had no justification in doing so. 40 metres out from goal. Third goal for Darren Ogier, seventh for Carlton. It took a lot of getting, it comes up at the 17-minute mark. Heritage, great hand pass to Robertson from centre-half forward. Hooked it a bit. All Carlton, though, Ogier. Three marks to number 34, Darren Ogier. This quarter, Carlton have kicked 1-5 to Fitzroy, one straight. They've had nearly all the attacking into the wind, but haven't got it on the board. And there's that mark at the back to uh, Ogia. A goal each in this last turn, 14 minutes gone. That clears Barwick. At the back, Ogia. Carlton looks... Plays on quickly. Went for the hand pass, then kicks long towards the forward line. And a good mark. Taken for the Blues by Ogier, only 15 metres out directly in front. They've started well, Carlton. Um, they appear to be kicking into what is a fairly strong breeze. The flags are suggesting that the wind is favouring Hawthorne down to the main grandstand end, so uh, Carlton are doing well to get it up their four line so quickly. Out towards the wing. 
Fiji it comes up for the Blues. One grab, picks it up nicely. Kick around the corner. Oh, great mark by Fraser Murphy. Sensationally up the half forward. Kernahan slips away from Langford. Goes long into the wind. Gallagher's there, but in front of Ogier. And Ogier's got it again. Good mark by Darren Ogier backing into them. I thought the other young guy was in, in between he, Ogier, and the Hawthorne defender, but the picture then showed that he was, he did get behind, but Ogier took a great mark. Coming up for his second goal, right in front, 20 metres out. He's kicked both of Carlton there. There's a replay now. I didn't see anything. There was there. nothing there. He set himself to take the specky. Nothing at all. has already kicked two goals and coming from a Carlton man I feel that was a charity before Carlton in support kicks it high towards half forward high flyer is Ogier sensational mark by Ogier play on quickly and that'll be 15 metres but he doesn't mess around Kernahan a long low trajectory drop cut all that's a beautiful mark it would have been a free kick anyway in fact he is playing the free kick I think McKenzie will take this it was a strong yes. mark, though. Wasn't? What a gutsy right effort. The back and a great mark, wasn't it? Yep. But still, it's a... Uh... This is Gleeson running across his own half-forward line. He hoisted high down towards the half-forward line. And the mark is taken by Ogier. About... Long handball to Jim Buckley. One of the uh, emergencies for the seniors. In fact, all three emergencies are playing in the second. So Carlton will go into the seniors with their 10. As uh, Ogier, another one of those emergencies, marked strongly. And he can cap off a fine piece of cart football that started in the back line with a goal. His 11th possession with that mark. Yes, you've got plenty of uh, high-marking players up on there on this Carlton forward line. If it's not Ogier, it's Porcinides. Which would be... And now it's Ogier lining up this one from only 25 metres out. What's he done with it? I think he's kicked it. Yes, that's Ogier's first goal for the afternoon. Right up into the goal square. Oh, lovely mark, Ogier. He went almost alone. Unattended. Yeah, it's too easy, that one, Jeff, wasn't it, really? Yeah. You're right, Bernie. Look, crikey. He just threaded his way through about four disinterested Saints then. Yes, I should have had a taller player standing at yeah. least in front of the pack. And it's Ogier lining up for his second. And he's made no mistake with that one. Darren Ogier's second goal for the afternoon. Two goals for him.